I'm doing a free pause on Thursday. Good morning, Apaches. Today is Friday, Thursday, April 14th, 2022. Please stand for prayer and remain standing for the pledge. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Immaculate Mary, seed of wisdom, pray for us. St. Anthony, patron of our school, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Please face the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for announcements. Happy birthday today to Orlando Martinez. Happy birthday, Orlando. Uh, we don't have lunch today, Patches, because it is a half day. And the Pope Francis of the day is, God's presence is so humble, hidden, so invisible, that it needs an intensive, intensive, awake, and welcoming heart to be recognized. Hashtag Eucharist. Hashtag Holy Thursday. Students, today is the last day for 40 days of giving. Be sure to drop by Coach Fichek's office to donate. Antonian will be holding auditions for morning announcements starting this week. Students will be chosen to represent rep oh, sorry, represent their grade level. For more information, please contact or email Coach Fichek or Ms. Medina to set up a time for auditions. All auditions will be held in the media room upstairs in the tech center. Seniors, if you're planning on attending the senior sunset, you must RSVP by tomorrow at 4 p.m. Coach Fuchsack sent out an email this past Sunday with a Google form to RSVP. <clears throat> ACP Drama brought home the 6A Speech State Championship with a state championship <laughs> in each event. Pop musical vocals with performance from Frozen, three separate judges ranked with number one rankings for superior performance. Solo acting state champion Logan McCrossin, second place. Jared Ramirez, fourth place. Danielle Despino, act, duet acting state champion. Logan McCrossin and Maya Crane, third place. Jared Ramirez and Clarissa Cortez, eighth place. Ray Rodriguez and Storm Goodman, pros interpret state champion. Clarissa Cortez, fourth place. Ella Peterson, poetry interpret state champion. Colt LaCroix, second place. Nate Boat, fifth place. Mary Bo. Students, as the school year is drawing to a close, please return all your library books no later than Friday, April 29th. Start, starting May 2nd, the fine for any outstanding library books will be accumulate, accumulated at 25 cents per item per day. A lost or damaged book may be replaced by a book with some title, with the same title and author, or you may pay for its replacement fee with the cost of the book plus $5 per processing fee. Take action now to clear your library account. Thank you. Mr. Reese and Mrs. Del Negro are sponsoring a nine-day trip to England and Ireland, June 10th through the 18th, 2024. There will be an information meeting at 6 p.m. on Thursday, April 28th. Seating is limited and on first-come, first-served basis. Keep a lookout for posters with QR codes coming soon. In the meantime, contact Mr. Reese at rreese at antonian.org for more information. Teachers, please do a dress code check now and send an email to Ms. Martinez in the front office if a student is not in compliance. Your national day today, Apaches, is National Dolphin Day. Your joke of the day is, what do you call a person from Finland who is extremely boring? What? A dolphin. <laughs> okay. That's funny. All right, Apaches, your fun fact of the day is... Last night, I woke up at 2.30 a.m. feeling something on my head, and I was really confused, and I was like, what is that? And I look up to feel it, and it's furry, and I <laughs> originally thought it was my duck that I had gotten previous week, but it wasn't because my duck didn't live with me anymore. And then as I touched it, it like kind of nibbled at my finger, but it didn't pierce my skin. <laughs> and I turn on my flash, and I just see a possum staring at me <laughs> that was sleeping on my head <laughs> and I freaked out and 
yeah, I'm doing okay now. But that was my fun fact, and a lot of my friends wanted me to share with the school, so here I am. <laughs> okay, <laughs> all right, Apaches, your ending time is 8.42 a.m. Thank you, and have a free possum Thursday. <laughs> that is my fun fact.